Wanted man on the loose. Police are trying to track this suspect down in connection to the kidnapping and murder of Tiffany Jones. Hello again, I'm Ava Joy Burnett. As investigators remain on alert, tonight the community prepares to hold a second vigil in honor of Tiffany Jones. WJZ is live in the Brooklyn neighborhood. Alex Dimitrik has more on where the investigation stands right now. Alex? We'll have a joy with the arrest of one suspect. This case boils down to the hunt for a second. Kidnapped in broad daylight from Petit Street on Tuesday, her body found tied and burned in the basement of this abandoned row house on Wednesday. Solving the murder of 29 year old Tiffany Jones started with one strong lead. Recovering the vehicle uh, helped our investigation, it aided in our investigation, and got us closer to identifying suspects. Police allege 28-year-old Bobby Barncourt drove the kidnapped vehicle and set the fire. She also identified 35-year-old Willard Turner Williams in the abduction and killing. Finding him is the focus of the case. Police think they know the motive. We know that uh, some of the reasoning behind this was uh, just a petty argument, petty disagreement. And that's what we see a lot of this um, uh, nonsense, this violence over petty uh, stuff. Neighbors say Bobby Barncourt and Tiffany Jones were frequently seen together. The sad part is the girl was hung with Tiffany all the time. They were together out walking and walking around, going to the little corner stores. Well, what that disagreement was about is unknown. Meanwhile, this evening, friends will be gathering to remember Tiffany Jones at the site of where she was murdered. Reporting from Brooklyn, Alex Dimitri, WJZ.